Hey everyone, welcome back to week 2 of our agentic process automation journey. This week, we are diving deeper into both the developer and leader track, unlocking the real power of AI in the process automation. On the developer track, get ready for some hands-on action with prompt engineering, data classification, transformation and test using Gen AI tool. Meanwhile, in the leader track, we are focusing on the strategic side, governance, scaling, and managing AI-related risk across your organization. Let's gear up and continue building a smarter, faster, and more intelligent automation. We are diving deep into the exciting world of AI agent capabilities, both from developer and leader perspective. In this video, I will walk you through all the courses I completed under week two from both the tracks. The first one is developer masterclass. Second one is leader masterclass. Let's start with a developer masterclass first. In first video, we learned about crafting effective prompts with CoStar framework. This module helped me to understand how to structure a prompt using CoStar framework. It's powerful method to engineer prompt that consistently give you the quality output from Gen AI model. In the second video, we learned about classifying data with AI agents. Here I learned how to build a classification logic using AI agents that transforming unstructured data into structured output without writing a critical rules. For example, automatically classifying incoming emails into compliant, enquiry or a feedback categories. In the third video, we learned about analyzing sentiment with AI agent. This video demonstrated how AI agent can perform sentiment analysis, identifying whether a customer message is positive, negative or neutral. It's super useful in customer service and feedback analysis automation. In the fourth video, we learned about extracting named entities with AI agent. We explored entities extraction using a Gen AI, which help pull out critical business terms like names, amounts, or dates from unstructured documents. This is crucial when you are automating a document processing task. And in the fifth video, we learned about testing AI accuracy with F1 score. This one was technical. We learned about F1 score, which is a metric to measure a accuracy of AI model. It balances precision and recall to give us a reliable performance score. In the sixth video, we learned about transforming data with AI agents. Finally, this module taught us how to utilize AI agent to transform the business data into structured formats like converting free text log into JSON format or XML format or any other different structured format for your downstream process. As you can see on the screen, I have completed all these six models successfully. If you are having any doubts on this particular models, please comment on this video comment section. We will try to help you with the answer. Next, Let's look at the leader track week two. This track is designed for those in a strategy, governance or leadership role, helping them to implement and scale AI driven automation in their organization. Totally, we have a five different videos in this week. And the first video we are learning developing talent for generative AI program. This session is focused on how to build and upskill the team for generative AI aligning our roles, responsibilities, and training paths. Very important for AI center of excellence team. And in the second video, we are learning about monitoring and optimizing AI capabilities. This module explained how to track the performance of AI agent in the production using AI metrics, helping us to identify when AI need retraining or optimization. In the third video, we are learning about managing AI risk effectively. Here we learn how to manage risk like hallucination, bias or drift in AI outputs. It empathizes strong governance framework for safe AI usage. 
and in the fourth video we are learning about controlling access and auditing use this session is introduced policies and best practices for controlling access to ai tool and auditing their usage especially important in regulated environments and in the fifth video we are learning about how to test a generative ai this one is about defining robust testing strategies for gen ai making sure our model deliver consistent and explainable result that stakeholders can trust all five modules from the leader track are also completed as shown on the screen let's wrap up week 2 of our agentic process automation journey quick recap developer track focused on hands on ai capabilities like prompt engineering classification transformation and testing leader track focused on governance scaling and risk management of ai within the organization both track complement each other beautifully whether you are building a solution or driving a strategy stay tuned for week 3 where we will start implementing what we learned so far don't forget to like the video share with your peers and subscribe to my channel ai brahma for more such content see you in the next one happy learning go be great